Hi, uh, today we're going to be making a jumper cable. This is called a, this is an RG6 cable, commonly used for television. So we're going to be making one of these. So I've already got some cable over here that I already cut up. Now this is 18 gauge, so you want to get it properly. So what you're going to need is a stripper. You're going to need a crimping tool. You're going to need cutters. And you're gonna maybe one of these, a box cutter, but you might not. And a connector. This is an RG6. So first things first, get this part and you're gonna line it up. You got some some razors in there that will cut this to the to the right size. So let's put this in here. Get it on there, give it a couple twists. Go back the other way. And that should come right off. So that's what it's going to look like after you, uh, you strip the, the ends of it. So you have metal, uh, there's uh, braided metal right around the outside. So and you want to peel that back away from the interior insulator. The yellow portion that surrounds the this the copper interior, that's called an insulator. That's the white stuff, that, the white part that you see right there. That surrounds the copper uh, conductor. So this, uh, the copper conductor, that's what carries all your signals. So you don't want any of the braided steel to touch to it because you'll ground it out. So now you get this part and you want the end of it, this part, to go on there. So let's put that on there. And make sure you line it up on the inside, otherwise you'll cut it. And if you can, make the, the inside uh, insulator be flush with, with the interior lip of, uh, of, the, of this connector. You just like that. And you don't want this, the conductor part to stick out too far because if you do that, it's gonna mess up your, uh, your, your cable. So then as soon as you get it like this, then go ahead and put it straight into there. There's a hole on the inside of this, the lever that's moving up. So you just put the conductor inside of there, push that down, and then just crimp it. And that's it. Your, now your cable's nice and done. And that's how you make one of those cables. So hope you enjoyed the video.